Jonathan here, one of your TAs. I'm going to show you some of the basics of editing a WordPress blog. So we've gone to add a new post, and we can see that we're clearly adding a new post. I type in the title up here. For this example, it's going to be Learning the WordPress Basics. And I've just typed in some text so that the video doesn't take quite as long to show you. So what I want to do is I've got Editing Basics here, and I want to make this a, a large heading, because it's a big heading in my blog. I look across the top and I don't see anything immediately, but I do see this button on the end which says show or hide the kitchen sink. So I'll click on that and I see, oh, here's a drop down for headings and text formatting. So I want this to be a big heading. Heading one, editing the basics. Great, how I'm going to teach you the basics of creating WordPress, WordPress blog. And then basic text manipulations just for curiosity's sake. I want to make this another heading. I want to make it heading three. Basic tip text mani manipulations. Um, unordered list. So how did I create this unordered list? Well, simple. I started a new line and I clicked the unordered list button and I said, okay, unordered list one, unordered list item two. And I probably would make sure that I spelled it correctly, etc. So now if I want to add some bold text, I just highlight the text I want, click bold. If I want italic text, I'll highlight that text and I'll click italics. Next thing you might want to do is quote from a source. So we'll just highlight what we want to quote as long as it's longer than two lines and otherwise you probably don't need to have a block quote is what they call it. And I'll click this block quote button and we can see that it indents it easily. Okay, so now the kitchen sink. Let's have another heading here. I'm going to make another big heading because this is separate from my first heading. And I'll scroll down and I'll see, okay, blah, 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 link to an external page. So let's just break this link because I've already done this. Now let's say that I was writing along and I wanted to link to another page to um, provide credible or credibility for what I'm writing about. So I'll click on this insert or edit link button and I'll type in the URL or I'll paste it. But for now, I'll just type in a URL and I'll say, okay, here is the title of this web page I'm going to go to and I'm going to click add link. Now we can see that it turned the link purple in my case because I've already visited the page. And if I mouse over it, I can see that the title is what is put up in the hover. So as you can see in the image below, even in bleepity blurp, bleep plop flop. So I'm going to add an image here. So how do I add an image? I click on Upload or insert, I have add an image. Super. Choose one of the files from my computer. Yeah, that's about what I want to do. I could also do it from a URL somewhere on the internet or from my picture gallery. Um, WordPress stores a gallery of all of the pictures that I've already uploaded and then I can just reuse them in other posts or from my media library, which is another thing that's stored on uh, WordPress. So I'll just choose a file to upload. So I'll go to my desktop. Super, and I will just upload a picture that I have on there. It takes only a second, and then it crunches it, and then I can save all of the attributes of this picture that will then be saved in my gallery. So whatever I type here will actually, halak typo, will end up being saved in my gallery. So the caption, I don't need any of this. Uh, there's my URL, etc. So what I want to do is I want to insert it into my post. Where do I want to align it? I want no alignment and I want it to be medium size. No, I want it to be large size. Perfect. So I'll just click on the large button here. Oh, actually full size is probably better. Insert into post. And here we go. It then shows up right there. Anyway, the next thing I do is I could create some other headings. Let's create another one and bleep, bleep, blurp, blurp. And that pretty much covers all the basics. All right, good luck.